Hey, but first of all, please press on the subscribe button. Press the bell icon on YouTube app and never miss another update. Hi guys, welcome to my channel Cooking Time and Natural Remedies. So today I'm going to be uh, showing you guys on how to get rid of colic and in babies, infants, toddlers, um, or maybe a stomach ache. Okay, so I know that you could use the usual colic, um, I don't know, drips or drops, whatever it is. Um, but otherwise, today I'm going to be showing you guys on how to get rid of them naturally, and this really works. Trust me, it works. I've used it for my baby, it has always worked. Uh, there are three ways to consume this, so let's see how we make this, and then I'll show you guys how to consume. Oh, and by the way, stay tuned, subscribe because I've got more videos coming. There will be a video that will show you how to make your baby to exercise. Even if they're infants, you can still make them exercise and that could eventually get rid of the colic that they've got. Alright, so I've got a little bit of water in my pan, so the amount doesn't matter, so you can use as much as you want. I mean, obviously when you're boiling it, but when you're uh, giving it to your baby or the toddler, I'll show you guys how much you need to be using for what age, alright? Okay, so basically, I've got this water put on the hob, and then what you want to do is turn on your hob. The first thing that you would use, something called fennel seeds, okay? So, and then something called ajwine, okay? So you would put one pinch of each. I would suggest you keep the water to minimum so it's not more than you need it, okay? So I would leave that to boil and then I'll show you guys how you could make your baby consume it. Oh yeah, so once it comes to the boiling point, leave it for one or two minutes so that both of the ingredients have mixed together and the flavor has been left in the water so then we'll strain it so just to let you know both of these ingredients you can find them in all the asian groceries so wherever you live in and you see an asian grocery or any asian shop you should be able to find these you know otherwise you can ask them they will guide you you know where you can get them because these are very popular in asian communities all right so it has now come to a boiling point i'll leave for two to three minutes and then i'll wait for it to cool down a bit so it doesn't burn your child you know that's important all right so first of all i'd like to strain this i'm using a strainer and i'm using a bowl so that it gets cooled down a little bit faster than usual so yeah that's strained all right so while that's getting cooled down i'd like to let you know how much uh the amount you can use for what age all right ideally I would use it from uh, a newborn to be honest but the guidelines are to be using it from two months and over um, but I would leave that decision to you guys I have used it on my newborn it hasn't it hasn't created any problem for them because it's natural something very natural as you've seen I've just used water edge wine and um, fennel seeds so yeah so if you're newborn, uh, this is obviously your decision if you want to. 2.5 mil, that should be fine, that should be more than enough. You can always uh, give this to a um, newborn if you want. I have tried this, as I said. This is a disclaimer, so if this is up to you if you want to use it for a newborn. But otherwise, if you want, you can use it from 2 to 3 months. Okay, so this is suitable for uh, toddlers, for, um, I don't know, infants, anything, any any child that you want. It's natural, it doesn't have any, well, it doesn't have much side effects unless your child has got allergies with those ingredients, okay? Um, so, yeah, so that's cooled down a little bit and I'm going to be using the syringe. It's the Calpol syringe, but obviously you can use any syringe. The reason I'm using the syringe is because it marks how much you can you know give so first of all I would if your baby likes the taste and you've tried it a couple of times maybe before you can always just take 2.5 mil and just, just give it to them as it is otherwise if they don't like the taste for 
an infant you can use just a small amount of milk and then just mix it with the milk and then give it to them just give it a little bit of a stir and then that should be fine give it to them as like usual milk I'm sure they'll like it so yeah and you st if you still think that they don't like it just use a little bit of um, honey and that should be fine and then what you could do also so that was two ways on how to give your baby if it's a toddler and they like to use their water bottle a lot so I've got this water bottle okay you can put them in the inside the water bottle and they will just consume it as if it's water I mean I wouldn't suggest you mixing it with water because it has already got water on it otherwise for my toddler I just use this and I just give it to them hopefully for a lot of toddlers you shouldn't get a lot of colleagues it's usually on the newborns and the infants so yeah all right so that's it for this video I hope you like this video don't forget to share it subscribe to it and stay tuned because I am going to come with more videos natural remedies and obviously cooking time videos okay then I will wrap it up there take care guys bye